case any of you guys are wondering, I keep panning past this plant that I got over here. Uh, this is a pineapple plant that's probably been growing for like two years. Um, it was big at one time. All right, it died all the way back. Uh, and here it comes again. It's coming back. Uh, it just lives and dies and lives and dies. I'm hoping to get a pineapple out of it, but I don't really care, you know. Um, but yeah, this was the top of a dull pineapple that I cut off and I rooted. Uh, if you ever see them, they core the centers of the, of the tops of the pineapple. If you ever buy a pineapple, look at the very top. You'll notice that the that top of it has been cored. Uh, that's so you can't uh, take that top, drop it in the ground, and get a pineapple out of it right away. Because generally, you, that could happen if the conditions are right and everything. Um, but that doesn't matter. You, all you need to grow pineapple is that root ball, on the, that ball at the base. There's like down here. There's like a, you know, a, a, a base, and you peel off all the leaves around it. It's like a, uh, like a, like almost like a bulb, almost. And that's what you need to get the roots out of. That's basically all you need. And all the rest of the stuff could die off. It'll shoot up its a new top anyway. You could also get seeds from a pineapple. And uh, that's, uh, that's, that might, maybe I can do a video on that at some time in the future. How to get seeds from a pineapple and actually try to grow it. Uh, I've, I've tried it. I've never actually had luck doing that, but supposedly there's ways you could do it and people have done it and um, I guess that's just the way it propagates itself, but uh, I think these also propagate through suckers too. They, they run out like suckers and pop up and stuff, um, but uh, yeah, you can, you can uh, grow these from seed if you know how to get them out of the pineapple. And uh, we'll, I'll give you updates on this from time to time. But yeah, that's just a basic pineapple, dull pineapple I bought from the supermarket. And that's uh, been growing for about two years. So I think I started it uh, in spring of last year, actually. So maybe it's only about a year. But it's going, it, it was wintered over. I started it in spring last year. Grew it out. Got pretty big. Died back through the winter because I forgot to water it. Now these plants could, these pineapples could virtually live in almost complete, without water for months on end. Um, and that's what I tend to do sometimes with some of the stuff I winter over and I stick them in areas I don't remember that I stuck them in. Uh, they do need a little light throughout the winter, but um, I almost barely ever watered it through the winter and it pretty much survived a lot of seed. It died, all that died back because I didn't water it. But yeah, they can handle quite a bit of drought. In fact, pineapples do not like a large amount of water. They like wet, dry, and they don't like it frequently. These grow really well in a hot, dry environment. Uh, not necessarily not humid. I didn't say that, but I said dry, meaning the ground isn't always constantly soaking wet. I don't know what that was behind me. Um... So yeah, we'll we'll I'll, I'll follow. I'll let you guys follow this through the summer. Let you see what goes on with it. I, I don't. I've never gotten pineapples to come out of uh, do ever doing this, and I've done this several times before. I've had pineapples, you know, two feet, three feet in diameter. You know, like if you look at the whole thing from the leaves, the way it is spread out, and it's huge. Never got a pineapple out of it. They're a very long season thing. I think they take a few years before they actually produce a pineapple, so you'd have to bring it in and bring it out and bring it in and bring it out. Uh, you know, I just, I, I can't do that. I got a lot going on uh, to begin with, so uh, anyway, that's just a quick look at the uh, pineapple plant I got.